What's going on, everybody? Doc Average Gamer Guys back yet again. More Escape Series action. As always, picking up where we left off. Here's what we got running. Gonna try to finish out this push to level 15. We're getting very, very close. So 13,754 gets us to level 14, and then we probably need another 25 ish or so. Okay, maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less, and we will finish this thing out. So. We're 14 raids in, not the best survivability here. I was hoping for a little bit more, but we did a lot of low geared runs. And uh, I think at the end of last episode, I talked about what do I wanna do from a perspective of hanging on to the money, buying a Lucky Scab junk box, going that route. I ended up selling off quite a few things. We did get enough money to buy it, but I have held off because we are so close. So I'm hoping with this episode, we can finish that Excuse me, we can finish that off and then we'll see where we want to go from there. What we got going? Sorry, I got the burps today. What we got going for this one, we're just going to get loaded in right now is some rain. <laughs> it looks like uh, in addition, we're going to jump in and we are going to try to get uh, extortionist done. That's going to be the push here. We're going to see if we can pick up some gear along the way, get some scavs, get a little bit of PVP. And if this goes well, We'll jump over to customs because we have a couple other quests to do. We got to get some scav kills. I actually have to do a woods raid survival as a daily as well. So we can pick up some nice experience there. And uh, again, if all goes well and we get a little lucky, we should have a good chance of uh, finishing out level 15 today. So without further ado, hit you with the intro and we'll see you in the raid. Okay, so this is a little interesting. I just spawned and we are two minutes into the raid. Not ideal. Not ideal. what we got going on here I'm gonna run over do a little bit of looting on this side I think I'm gonna check to see if the director's office is open actually dang because we could get that we'll still need the key um Some, still need the key at some point, but where did that scab just come from? I said, calm, calm, communicate from you dirty sons of bitches. You wanted me to say something else. Didn't ya? Didn't ya? Watch out. Watch out. 
Anyways, back to our regularly scheduled programming here. That is really interesting, though, the fact that, uh, again, we spawned so late. This little armor to boot. I'm gonna be a chunky boy. Which comes the worst. Gotta swap. like any of this was touched so the dilemma here for me always check that there's gonna be weapons in there the dilemma here for me is going to be pathing the smartest pathing for extortionist i don't know if i need the 218 key doesn't sound familiar um what i was saying the smartest pathing for me at this point would be ooh, that's a mm, nah. would be for me to go across go crack house essentially come over crack house and or past crack house roll by stronghold and out Is that a dead guy? Is that a dead guy or debris? I legitimately can't tell. It's a nice bag. And we're pipping the hell out of this. Damn. Jeez. It's debris. Looks like a dead guy. I don't think it's okay. That's the best pathing be to do that. It's a little bit of a risky pathing. I had some filing cabinets here too. This was hit, it looks like. Okay, now, here's the cool part about this. Bye to all those. Pack this bad boy up. Wish I could throw that on there too. That needs a mount though, fortunately. We could totally go into the scab weapons here. This AKM's not bad. If we had a little bit more ammo for it, I'd really think about it. interesting that they put these in filing cabinets. I wouldn't have thought that was something that would have gone in there. It's like they kind of reverted back, but also kept some stuff the same from last wipe. Filing cabinets last wipe were just not good in the slightest. And they definitely got better this wipe, which is nice. Um, looking for anybody posted up trying to get shooter borns. They definitely got better this wipe. It's 
some of the stuff just doesn't make sense. Like to me, folders of intelligence, keys. I, I think keys need other places to spawn besides the permanent ones. Not the permanent ones, but the, the base spawns for a few keys. And jackets. I think you could... There's just so many needed keys in the game that... Just feels like to me the RNG of keys needs to change a little bit, I guess. Same. Cheeky breaky, but chewy. Gosh, we got some good stuff. That freaking sucks. If we could have taken that bastion off and swapped it in onto that other gun. 100%. This is probably where I die. See all what was hidden here. Need a standard bandage too. For another daily. Oh. If we can get extortionist and get our survive here, Oof. GGs. This fits on, oh, no, that fits on a Saiga, I think. It's a good stock. <laughs> I 
It's interesting that this wasn't hit. I'm not surprised about that, to be honest. Gonna need lots of those. There's somebody sitting upstairs. Somebody might be outside. Being weird. I really don't think I need two eighteen. I hope I don't. Power bank is pretty solid. <coughs> I'll be able to use this for like the few things. We need a uh, power code. This room used to be so good, and it's just, just like everything. The dynamic loot, I think, has been good for a lot of the gameplay changes. However, I do think there should be some stuff that remains, like, pretty solid. And unfortunately... Nope, that right. Unfortunately, some of this stuff has not. Alright. I thought I had heard somebody over here, but... Normally I would think about going in here. I'm not going to. Just gonna try to get our extortionist here. We've got some. Fuck that guy, man. Thought I was gonna shot at by a player there for a minute. Scav. If he didn't lay down, I would try to shoot him, but I don't got the uh, the, uh, the sights for that. We're probably going to just jump over the wall here. through warehouse four slash switch building. Somebody's already 
already been through. Can they not go in here now? player. I wish I could have sighted him up, man. Damn. He hit him a couple times. Here ends up being the problem. The thing I need. thing I need is out here. That was a peace gap. Check this. I don't ever remember. I think it's this one. Ali Logistics Key. Really hoping our guy just bailed. Thinking he did after those couple of shots. a nice little AK. know what to do. I'll find more of these, I guess. <laughs> hey, look at that.
One thing I'm really worried about is this player still kind of hanging out. Looking okay here. Really hoping he's just left. What I'm actually doing really quick. Checking. That's not on, which sucks. So we could have taken the other ZB there. <clears throat> Had it been. Check to see if this key is here. Does not appear so. And we bring on the heavy rain. All right. We're just going to try to make it. Dead scabs there sure gave me a little bit of a spook because I was like, man, I'm wondering if this guy is just, he killed some scabs on the way out. <clears throat> now he's going to bait him. He knows we're headed that way. I would say GG's to that raid. 4K experience. Very nice. Nice little scab headshots. I was thinking about this. It's almost probably, it's like sort of good. Uh, not great, but still kind of sort of good that maybe we didn't kill that player because I could have been looting that player when that scab was walking by. We get into a different kind of fight there instead of just getting a clean headshot on that. So, hey, we'll take it. That's a nice chunk for what we need here. Okay, and here's the loot haul. Actually, very happy. Um, we get 35k just like straight up. Some USD, which is really nice. Smokebox lava will sell really, really well. We get a couple of things that we're going to need, uh, actually. So that's also very good. Very, very good. And um, we can actually get rid of this now, too, which is fantastic. So what I want to do very quickly is <clears throat> let's get some tasks done. Army bandage, turn it on in. Aseptic bandage, turn it on in. Complete that. I have to survive a woods raid, so we'll look to get that done. And then Extortionist, we get to complete this as well. We get some pretty solid rewards early on. We need to do Stirrup, and we need to find some flash drives. So PMCs, we see pistols. Um, <clears throat> what we may look to do here, I'm probably... Mm. So here's the thought process, and here's something actually that works somewhat well if you're trying to go about um getting a few of these uh, quests done in multiples i would say so the thought process would be see if we have we have some some grotches we have some uh mp443 pistols here what we could do and what i've done actually this wipe on my main account is run 
one of our Mosins with a pistol backup. And what that's gonna allow you to do is if you can get an early Mosin shot on somebody, boom, hit them in the chest, hurt them decently enough, you can then do a quick swap to your pistol and you can actually you can actually wreak some, some freaking havoc um, on some folks. So it's kind of an interesting dynamic or something to think about, but it ends up being a pretty solid strategy. I'm thinking that's what we're gonna go do considering we need to do two things. Uh, we're not going to kill Tagilla. I could actually probably look to replace this, and I might do that. We need to go and get a survive on woods. In addition to that, we're going to start getting our scavs on woods here knocked out. We need some 40 meter headshot and uh, leg shots. This doesn't have to be on scavs anymore. It used to have to only be on scavs. It can now be on anybody. Um, so we're sitting really nice, to be honest with you, and uh, we can run over to woods and hopefully have some success there. Um, so we're going to get unpacked. That's what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to go pistol and Mosin. So we'll get set up for that, and we'll see you in the raid. All right, so our goal here is leg and head shots and scabs in the ground. Holy rain. We're just going to drop that there about two notches. Now, we also have a chance. If you're ever wondering why your gun does that, it's because there's not a round placed into the chamber, so you gotta rack it. There is a high percent chance. There's going to be a player coming from this other direction. Or up from the top. Plus, of course, nobody wants to deal with the rain, which I wholeheartedly would not blame them for. I'm going to take the bolts. Those are all good things. Ooh. You know what I do need? Silly as it is. I need a TP. Firm my butthole. Oh, I'm just kidding. I need it for lavatory. It's the last item I need for lavatory. Here's what we're gonna do. Let's go up here. Ooh. Oh, just a chain lit. Get my hopes up, game. I wish this tree wasn't here. Oh. I got a perception dot. What do we got here? A horsey. Okay, okay. Not bad, not bad. To stick around here too long. Thermometer solid. We got some goodies here. We got some goodies. Mayo would have been good for dehydration. This smokes your hydration. Do you have it? Access to the flea market when you go to do that quest. Strongly recommend. Just grab a mail. I was doing there is just checking. Just 
just making sure. These houses, this village is very good. I talked about this in the past, probably in a previous uh, episode too. Good solid loot. Lots to look at. Sprats right there. Sounds like something's hiding on me. So with the power cord that we got last uh, raid, I did, I was able to get um, nutrition unit built, which is actually pretty cool. Am I gonna get lucky enough to find something under every single one of these beds today? Ooh, doggy. I don't know, that's probably dumb. I can't believe we found something on every single bed. I'm gonna put this up here too. Hmm. Okay, yeah, what do we not need? I don't need the creeps. I really don't need this mag. I do want to keep the keck tape. Keck tape is relatively expensive. It's definitely gone down here, but early on, very, very good item to grab. You need quite a few of them, you need a handful of them, so really good item to pick up. Now we missed one of the buildings, in my opinion, kind of the least needed to get looted. Not that it doesn't have good stuff, um, but BS ammo pack, that's also very nice. Okay, so now let's search this. We want to put ourselves in a position here to get some scavs, get a couple of things done. So I'm gonna to try to go do that. Rain like this is really interesting because it's loud enough that it's. Messing with everybody's hearing. Um, I, I still believe that that's a good muzzle break. It's good enough muzzle break. <laughs> back off. He's got range. He's got good range.
I don't even know, dude. How did that guy get all the way over there? I don't hear that dude at all. There's just something about this where I just kept getting shot in the leg, you know, it's like I'm getting shot in the legs look laying down looking at the guy And that's frustrating With BP Okay, well we need to survive and uh, that was that was pretty frustrating. I'm not sure um I just it's interesting i don't hear that guy make that flank he literally gets behind us and uh i just man i i don't know frustrating frustrating death there uh the rain certainly didn't help us a lot of things going against us in that regard but um we're gonna go ahead similar gear we'll jump back in see what we can do it's in right all right so we've handed an interesting had an interesting day of tarkov late spawn that last raid uh and now um i had to alt f4 because i couldn't get into a raid we're finally in we are finally in i'm gonna jump over here just gonna see what we can muster up a few good things it looks like Curious on here is if anybody's gonna follow in behind me. I'm gonna die. Oh my god, Ann Sturman's here. I didn't expect two super juice guys. How many times did I hit this guy? Twice with the pistol. Just couldn't get the headshot. The second guy being there really screwed me. Well, no level 15 today. That's going to be it, I think. Um, some frustrating raids. Some frustrating raids today. We had a good run on customs. That was good. That was good. We got some stuff done there. Which is nice. 
can equip these probably pull that back man oh man um we were not able to get our daily done here which would have been really nice i'd have really liked to get this car battery that would have been helpful um we didn't pick up any pistol kills we didn't get any any scabs nor do we get anything from any amount of distance uh which is unfortunate what we could look to do so we do not have to do this iron sights or with a Mosin, which you could look to do, and I may actually do here, uh, depending if we can get it modded out or not. The options, some better options, at least you can put a sight on is the VPO. The problem ends up being really early. There's no good options for sights. Uh, that ends up being a little bit of the difficulty. There's really no good, uh, I should rephrase that. There's really no good ranged sights. You need mechanic or um but really or peacekeeper to get some levels up to get to, to get any decent options for that and uh sometimes skier can have one or two decent optics for the most part but um and again unfortunately he you could hoard a bunch of these batteries and then get a uh, mosin with a with a scope on it but um, you probably your best option is actually an SKS with a PSO. That's that's really probably about your only ranged option. This site sucks, um, and you can't get a Mosin that doesn't that has the attachment slots on it. Um, actually, take that back. You could buy this and probably swap everything out that you needed. Um, if I'm not mistaken, actually, I think you can. But this is probably your better option is an SKS with a uh, PSO on it. But it has to be a bolt action rifle. So this won't work for that. Uh, but if you're looking for early range, that's not a bad, uh, not a bad deal. But a uh, little frustrating. Sorry about that. We will continue to push forward. Uh, we're sitting just shy of 14. So hopefully we can have a good episode and we'll see what that turns into on the next one. Quick plug here, like, comment, subscribe. Do appreciate all the support in the channel. Hopefully you're enjoying the series. Probably didn't learn much from this one besides how to die. Uh, but if you did, <laughs> good. Good. Hopefully you took something away. Uh, I'm going to flash some socials at you. Twitter, Twitch, Discord, TikTok. We stream over on Twitch. Friday, Saturdays, Sundays, when and during the week when we can. Usually in the evenings, EST. Come hang out. Follow us. Join us. We'd love to have you. Other than that, catch you in the next episode. I've been Doc. Average Gamer, guys. Peace.